Hi guys, my name is Elias and in today's tutorial I want to show you real quick how you can easily cut clips together and also make simple cuts in Premiere Pro 2023. So right now you, what you want to do is go to the source panel right here, open your folder and drag your clip what you want to cut and first of all you have to pick from clip which portion of the clip you want to use. That's the first thing you want to do. So as you can see, I can press I and O for the in point and out point. So it's I and O, you, you can remember that very easily. It's also mark in or mark out right there. So you can do the same thing right here. So I will do that right there. I want only this portion of the clip and I want only video. So I will drag only video. I will place it on my timeline and I will select other clip which is man on phone. I will drag and drop it in my source panel and as well I want right there when he scratches himself. So I want this portion so I click I on the, at the beginning and O at the end. So I will drag the video behind and this is basically how, I'm, how I made the cut uh, first method. So I can play it back for you and as you can see the cut has been made and I don't even use any tool unless uh, the source panel. So first of all you want to do this, you want to pick from your clip what you want to use. Don't just uh, throw everything on your timeline and expect uh, you can make order from it so quickly. So this is faster way, believe me. Uh, it will save you a lot of time. If you already have your clips on your timeline and you want to do some editing further, you can also use this razor tool or just press C or click on it. And as you can see, this tool will appear and anywhere you click on the clip, cut will be made. As you can see, I can then slide these clips wherever I want to because I have made the cuts. If you want to redo the cuts, you can click on Ctrl and Z, Ctrl Z, Ctrl Z, Ctrl Z. That will redo everything you just did. So let's say, for example, I don't want this last punch to be in here. So I press C, click on there and delete this. So I can press delete and slide this clip over to this next one. And the last punch won't be there. As simple as that. So if this video was helpful to you, write down in a comment what you want to see next and like the video, subscribe and I will see you in the next one. Bye.